Hi, in this lesson, we'll take a look at the People app here in Windows 10. Let's go ahead and let's open it up. We're going to come to our start, and I have a tile here for People. Now, the People app, it's just your contact list. It's a list of everybody that you have added. And if we open one of these up, you'll see we have phone number, email. You can add in a lot of information on here. If you have events on your calendar with this person, you can go ahead and you'll see that there, conversations. Lots of great information in here. You even have a place to see more where you might have some more information about them. If you want to go ahead and create a new contact, we'll look at that in just a second, and it'll show you all of the different information that we can give them. We also have over here on the right options like we can call this person with Skype. Once they're in our contacts, it's easy to go ahead and connect to them with Skype. If you've connected your phone to your computer, you can go ahead and call them on your phone from this device. You can also email them as well if you want. We can delete contacts. We can share a contact. And we can pin it. This is kind of interesting, I think. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And you'll see I can pin them to the taskbar. Do I want to pin a contact to the taskbar? Yes, I do. I'm going to click pin. And I can pin them to the start menu, and we're going to do that as well. So if I close this up and take a look, down here on my taskbar, there is Gary Colson. I have pinned him to the taskbar. So we'll come, we'll click on this, and it's going to open up, and it shows me his email. It's going to show me conversations he's having in email. And if I click on the arrow, you'll see that it'll take me back to mail, which is exactly where we were. Or we can go ahead and click on the people button and see his contact. And of course, it's call with Skype, email, or call with your phone. So it's a neat way to go ahead and, if it's somebody you contact frequently, pin it here to the taskbar so that you can get to it. Now, remember, we also pinned Gary here in our start menu. And he's right here. He has his own tile. And if we click there, it opens up his contact. So we click on see more again we have that now let's go and let's open up the people app again because i did promise i would show you what happens if you want to create a new contact you click on the plus sign and there you go and you have all of these fields where you can add different types of information for your contacts so now you know a little bit more about the people app but that's it for this lesson. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you next time.